If you're here, you wish to know. Welcome to What's News This Week, a weekly series when I speak about different releases that I found interesting, so I can keep up on you also. The first thing we're gonna talk about today is Benba. It's a story about families that move to another country and you will have to help a wife of the family to restore the recipes of food from homeland in order to get roots of your culture when you move to and the country also will see how people adjusting into the new environment so it's gonna be a fun story and a lot of food <laughs> for maybe we'll learn some recipes from the soul ninja or die shadow of the sun it's a platformer when you have only one button so i suppose you only do jump and uh, directions so uh, so you use your stick to di direct where to jump and uh, press one button to jump and it's a uh, directional mode you have from the game mm, i'm sure speed runs will love this game a lot gonna be an interesting experience ocean Horn 2 knights of the lost realm the first ocean Horn was a mobile game heavily inspired by zelda on mobile phones and ocean Horn 2 knight of the lost realm is uh, i'm sure it also was on mobile at some point but uh, they will release it on different platforms now now and it's also it's heavily inspired by another zelda games and uh, i'm sure it's gonna be interesting adventure because at, at some point i will have to probably check out the play <laughs> Hey, now we know it's this out. <laughs> Adore is a isometric game where you play as a druid and you have to tame and uh, c col collect creatures to order to capture the other creatures. So it's uh, like a Pokemon, but not exactly. Yeah, and uh, it's pretty much uh, all that I know. You will collect creatures, tame creatures, befriend, befriend creatures, <laughs> and build your team to order to fight with the other creatures. So, 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 Wait, maybe one. Who knows? Either way, Wait, it can be a fun game. A guy with a bubble. Uh, you on a cruise ship that uh, makes people go from one life, like in, in in between lives. Life souls will go from one life to other life. So you you, you kind of in limbo, and uh, there's some accident happened, and you have to go back in time, change some stuff in order to make sure that the accident won't happen. And uh, that already got me with the premise of uh, afterlife. Uh, life zim and a uh, bunch of quest puzzles. It can be fun, but the butterfly effect is interesting and some, um, sometimes. Depends on realization. And either way, um, wait, this can be a fun game. Mm. I nearly forgotten to mention that Baldur's Gate 3, one of the best RPG she probably is made in the last decade, will be released s this week. Oh boy. Mm. Boy, it's based on D&D, you probably already saw massive amount of YouTube videos about it. It's, it's gonna be awesome. You, you can make your own character from a bunch of different races. There are a lot of classes and subclasses. And, and a lot of um, opportunities to make a roleplay. Uh, it's definitely gonna be one of the best experiences for everyone who enjoys good stories and RPGs. And uh, it's on this week and I nearly forgotten about it. So, Baldur Gate 3 also out. Out of weekly access, finally, after three years, we should all enjoy it. It's Clash! It's a game about duels, about uh, samurai duels. So, re remember the Katsushima uh, duels? Now, uh, uh, imagine the whole game only about that, only about duels, which can be incredibly fun. So, here it is. This, I believe this game is gonna be really, really, really funny to play. Mm -hmm. The Collective! So, imagine the whole organization of Punishers, and uh, in this movie, the welcome. Uh, a, a new guy is in, and he will go and fight with the criminals who didn't get um, under the prison and uh, will, well, will do what, what the Punisher do best. It's some evil guys, yes. And there's a movie about the whole organization like this, so, so it can be fun. Uh, may, or maybe not. I'm not sure about this one. It may be fun, fun movie. I, I like the premise, but it may also be. Mm, may, we don't know until, until gun came out, so here it is. For an office, it may be an interesting comedy about office so there's uh, this guy who wo works in his office and who all collects uh, things that he's mental and one day he finds uh, a door that no one else notices and everyone's saying that this door does not exist there's no 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 room uh, no, no, the door opens door so, and um, he, he goes through the door there's a whole cabinet and he can do everything he thinking he put his mind into and uh, everyone else uh, says that he's just standing in front of the wall and does nothing. So, and uh, either the guy is crazy or uh, 
uh, is there is conspiracy in the circus this witch and science we as if you don't know <laughs> what, what, what's over there, uh, there. It's, it's an interesting mystery mystery and uh, that's why I, I would uh, I would watch this movie it's, it's it seems fun also Abbott from community and he's looking for Alexander Sergeyevich Pushkin that's strange she, she, she's a haircut but okay now you know this movie is it <laughs> and unfortunately that's all I found interesting this week so if you want this channel to live and grow please support me here on other social medias share my videos with anyone you think you share do whatever you do at the end of the video yeah, do jump platforms from youtube to twitch to twitter to whatsoever and thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video so stay nice. bye